Now that a few days have passed since dozens of tornadoes touched down in our area, we're taking time to look back to add context to the conditions and what we've learned since. Here's meteorologist Joseph Meyer. April 26, 2024 will be a day that will go down in weather history in eastern Nebraska and western Iowa as multiple strong tornadoes tore across the landscape. I'm meteorologist Joseph Meyer with a look on what happened back on that day. That Friday, an area of low pressure was moving into eastern Nebraska. This low pressure would provide the spin in the atmosphere for tornadic thunderstorms. Connected to that was a warm front that was draped to its east, and a cold front moving into eastern Nebraska provided the trigger. Supercell thunderstorms, the most dangerous type of storm, began developing southwest of Omaha around 1 p.m. One such supercell that developed southwest of Lincoln would go on to produce the Waverly tornado then moved into Elkhorn and Blair. More supercells developed in Cass and Odo counties. One of these went on to produce the tornado that hit Epley Airfield. The other would spawn the Minden Harlan tornado. Now the National Weather Service is still determining how many tornadoes happened, their width, their length, and the rating of those tornadoes. It'll take them several days to finalize that information. In Omaha, meteorologist Joseph Meyer.